Yes, good morning again. I am Dr. Madhuri Chatterjee and uh, from Government College, BBT Government College, Chimanpura. And we are still continuing with the parts of speech. I am just left with two more which you need to understand. And they are pretty, pretty easy. We have done noun and pronoun, verb, adverb, adjective, preposition. And we are now coming to something called conjunction. Now, what is the conjunction? Conjunctions are joining words. All right. Suppose Ram and Rahim. Ramesh or Rakesh, Ram and Rahim. I will come if you come. Now, if is a conjunction here. We go whether you come or not. So, whether or if or or and and they are all conjunction and they are usually used to join sentences. Now, I have some more examples for you. Suppose the company deals in both hardware and software and is a conjunction here second one i will eat either carrots or peas gajar ya matar okay so either is again a conjunction vakya ko jod raha hai next one is that i will drink neither milk nor cake neither milk nor milk and nor and neither they are both conjunction then you have do you care whether we have noodles or rice whether or is again a conjunction uh, it is such a tiny that i don't have to that that is a very important conjunction similarly you have scarcely i was about to enter when the bell rang main jaane hi wala tha when somebody called me when somebody called me when some so when is a aapke do vakya ko jod raha hai when is a conjunction and then you have no sooner did he enter the room that he saw the snake than he saw the snake so that is also a conjunction so these are all conjunctions which you have to both either neither whether not only such the that scarcely when no sooner and than then you have uh, other examples i have given you and you have because although whereas but besides unlike therefore provided unless then so if yet and after Uh, keep joining sentences keep joining words with the help of these conjunctions uh, and then there are some subordinating conjunction that is after and although as if as long as as much as as soon as i will come as soon as possible i will come now this is a complete almost a completion of a sentence but as i i will come as soon as possible i have extended the sentence i have made it a little i added another sentence to it i made it a compound sentence so what what did i do i have used as soon as or i will come because of you because is a con- subordinating conjunction i will come if you are coming i will come since you are there so since and less than provided and that and though and if jitne bhi aap kar sakte hain practice utna acha hai so they are all subordinating conjunction and finally finally we go to interjection and what are interjections are words which are used to express certain feelings or expression okay now example is alas the world is facing a pandemic now alas has got a uh, what you can exclamatory mark alas wow hurra all these are sudden expressions so hurra we have discovered a vaccine and soon we'll have a vaccine hurra we will soon have a vaccine okay so hurra or alas all these are interjection now you have a chart here aha bingo and gi and bu and wow and oops and bravo and these are all sudden expression wow i saw something oh great there's a rainbow in the sky so wow and hi and well so they are all interjection and then you have almost like hey and ha and all these but the basic ones are hurra and alas and joy you are showing a joy or you showing a feeling of sadness so you use interjection and that completes the parts of speech and now we'll be moving from simple sentences to compound and other sentences compound and complex sentences right 
so i'll just repeat once again we have done the noun and pronoun and verb adverb adjective preposition conjunction and interjection and this is a must this is something you might have done in school also and this is something very essential these are the very elementary things the elementary the most elementary things which you need to know before you start off and start making sentences all right thank you so much